The PNP politically desperate. It cannot fathom the thought of being in opposition for three consecutive terms. It cannot. It has never been in opposition for three consecutive terms. In the history of its 86 years, it has never been in opposition for more than two terms of a government, eight, ten years. Therefore, the comrades are desperate to win. They recognize that it's all to play for. And why do I begin with that? Because one, it is shaping their political strategy and thoughts. And therefore, you got what you got yesterday at the PNP's conference. A man of questionable character is hailed as a hero. And by the calculation of Dayton Campbell and Mark Golding, they have an election to win. And he has a whole lot of influence and sway. Therefore, they're not comfortable with it. When you listen to Campbell, Dayton Campbell and Angela Brown Burke struggling to justify it. But their calculation is we must win and win at all cost. While you were listening to me this morning in northern St. Andrew, the suburbs, yeah, you wouldn't go to a conference. You don't even go vote. You're not going to vote. But those 15,000 at the arena yesterday, they vote. They do have a problem with that gentleman. They don't. They welcome him because they know it is going to resonate in their communities, in their districts, in their bars. But what do you do about it? What do you expect when you turn your back on the process and you leave it up to them? That's what we get. And I dare say this morning, we are facing an existential threat to our democracy. If more and more of us, who this country has educated, given us a fairly decent life, refuse, continue to refuse to participate, then we're going down that slippery slope of no return. So when you condemn this morning, also commit that you must go back, find out which group is meeting, which branch is meeting, so you can go in there. Can you imagine? Just think about it. When that decision was made to have that gentleman on the stage, not in the audience, on the stage, who in the leadership of the PNP was courageous enough to stand up and say, no, not a backside. Who was courageous enough to do that? Huh? Where was Peter Bunting? Find that clip with Peter Bunting for me. That speaks to that gentleman. Where were they? We're joking. We're joking about Lady J.A. Yeah? The PNP 